The Bigger Bang Tour and the Rolling Stones roll into Halifax this weekend, and Colleen's going to talk to a fan who's already been all over the continent to see his favorite band play. That is coming up just after the break. The only way to be. Business up. I'm going to head back to Colleen now in Halifax to talk about something that most Haligonians, or at least many Haligonians anyway, are looking forward to this weekend. The Rolling Stones play the city tomorrow. You're going, Colleen? Yes, I'm going. Derek Mahoney's going as well. And uh, good morning to you, Derek. Hello, hello. But this is, you're not a rookie. How many have you been to? Uh, this will be my ninth. Really? Ninth, ninth time, yeah. How excited are you that you don't even have to at least get on a plane to go see them this time around? Well, you know, it's it's fun going on the trip, but, uh, you know, when I, when I looked at the ticket and seeing uh, the Stones in Halifax, I was really excited. Yeah, nobody yeah. ever thought they'd live to see the day that the Stones would come to Halifax, but we said that last year when it was in Moncton as well. Yeah. You were looking at the stage behind you, and you said, you don't even think they're ready yet, and the show's tomorrow. Well, you know, you look at it, it doesn't really look finished. They, they don't have the uh, Jumbotron or the or the speakers up, but, you know, I'm, I'm sure they've done it a hundred times. You they know? have done it a ton of times. They've been around for a long, long time. What is it about the Stones that you like? Because uh, you're a young guy. Well, uh, I was raised on the Stones music. My dad's a huge Stones fan, and so is my sister. Uh, I, I went to my first concert when I was 12, and I, I've sort of been following them around, you know, t t to different cities to sort of follow their tours and everything like that. And it just sort of, you know, I guess I was impressionable when I was young, and well, I, we all I, so are. <laughs> I, I sort of grew up with them, I guess. Yeah. This truck, by the way, behind you, probably carrying the Jumbotron. They've yeah. been loading, they've been, well, the process has been well over a week now. Yeah. Oh, Your yeah. favorite tune? Uh, I'd have to say, well, it's kind of hard, but Sympathy for the Devil or Paint It Black, you know, one of the old ones. Right Give on. Me Shelter, they always do a great job of that. Lisa Fisher, she's, uh, she has an amazing voice, you know. Yeah. What song gives you the goosebumps when they start singing? Is it one of their anthem songs? Or? Well, it's Sympathy for the Devil, I always love seeing that. They always play it too, and they always have a lot of good effects, fire, everything. Right. You know? Oh, I can't wait now. Now I'm excited that I've got tickets. Uh, Mick Jagger's presence, I mean, what do you say about his showmanship? Well, he's just, he's been doing it for over 40 years, you know, and uh, he, he's hes just, he knows how to bring presence to the stage and how to get the audience involved and how to, you know, work with the band. And, you know, he's just been doing it for so long. It's its its pretty much second nature to him, you know, he's pretty natural. Yeah, and you're going with your family and yeah. your sister's flying in from Toronto and all of that. They actually have Rolling Stones tattoos. Yeah, my sister has a Rolling Stones tattoo. And and my cousin has one, and my uncle had one. He's <laughs> he's no longer with us, but he, you know, it's sort of a family yeah. affair. You what know? about you? Uh, I've been con contemplating it, but yeah. I don't know. You know, yeah. tattoo is forever, right? It really is. Yeah. Now, um, what about the fact that it might rain tomorrow night? Are you a little? Well, you know, I'm not looking forward to like standing with a bunch of people in the rain, but whatever you know you, you got to do what you got to do and it's the stones you know in halifax why not you know yeah just... what was your reaction when they announced that the stones I, i'm sure people in regina felt the same way when it was announced there vancouver's used to their share of big concerts but what was your reaction when you heard it was halifax i, I didn't i didn't believe it i said no way you know i, I said the same thing for moncton but <laughs> until i actually held the ticket and i seen the stones on the commons i was like wow you know i, I actually believed it then yeah charlie watts you actually met him uh, yeah, a couple times, yeah. Um, we met him when I was 15 in Montreal. We were sort of hanging around, just seeing who we could see. We met the backup band and stuff. And then we went to England, and we, we uh, read that he was playing it with this jazz band. And we were sitting there, and he sort of came in earlier, and we were just, you know, he, he was talking to the people right beside us, and, you know, we called him over and started to exchange a few kind words. And, you know, it's, he's a really nice guy. And, you know, it's just, uh, well, it was thrilling. Definitely yeah. thrilling. Now, are you a full out groupie? Do you <laughs> hang out and try to figure out what hotel they're staying at? Apparently, they well, arrived today. People are guessing Delta, where. Delta you, Barrington oh, or Delta getting... Halifax. <laughs> but I don't know. I, I got to work today, so. You can't be a full out groupie. Yeah, well, you know, I, I did that when I was younger, and, you know, there, there's an age where, you know, yeah. You know, if I was like a teen girl or something, but no, you yeah. know. Is there any other band you're this fanatical about? You know, I mean, this was your ninth concert. Uh, well, you know, I've. I, I've been to a bunch of concerts like Aerosmith, The Who, and stuff. But I, I was for about two years of my life, I was really into The Doors, mm -hmm. and 
you know, I grew my hair long and all that stuff, but, you know, uh, I, there, there's only so much you can uh, hear from them, you know, because right. Jim Morrison's dead, and, yeah. but yeah. they're still going. Yeah, Rolling Stones tomorrow night in Halifax, and I know you'll enjoy it, so have fun. Thank you. I am the rookie, so we'll see well, how I'm I sure I will love time. it as well. I, I, there's something wrong with me if I don't have a good <laughs> time at the Stones. Uh, Heather, a lot, his sisters have the tattoo. I think we'll see him with the tattoo real soon. <laughs> I'm wondering about you, Colleen, actually. No tattoo for me, but I, as a rookie Stones person, I just want to go and soak it all in. Yeah, have a <laughs> no great tattoo, time. Though. Have a great well, time. When I get the tongue? Yeah, of course. The tongue, of course. I don't think exactly. not up on the back. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you both. Okay, just one big tongue. I can see it now. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, guys. Thank you very much. Keep the uh, Stones theme as we go to break here. Take a look at this. It'll give you a sense of uh, the world. Can I have a PC? And I feel inadequate. Okay. PCs get viruses. Good evening and welcome.